<gasps> Hi! <laughs> What's up, everybody? Sorry, I just turned on the camera so it wasn't calibrated. Calvin, move me up a little tiny bit, please. I got Calvin doing some uh, tech work behind the scenes. So thank you, Calvin. They gotta know that I'm wearing my General Kenobi shirt. All right, yeah, it does seem like maybe the colors look a little bit off. It does seem, it needs some calibrating, you're right. All right that immediately looks better to me. Yes, Garrus is calibrating my monitor. Calvin, if you are Garrus, then I am immediately more attracted to you. I hope that doesn't make things weird between us. Not at all. Okay. What? Now it's good, <laughs> awesome. Hey, you call me Garrus. I don't know what I mean. <laughs> all right, thanks. That was technical support, and this is your emotional support for Mass Effect, so look at the difficulty setting. Maybe Aaron tampered with it again. You're right, we should look. We're gonna go to options. We're gonna go to gameplay. We're gonna look and yes, we're playing on normal, as I do all games. Though I'm starting to understand why the galaxy needs cold-hearted dictators every now and then. They get things done? They don't give a damn about the consequences. Damn, Garrus. Suppose that's what it's going to take, Shepard. The ruthless calculus of war. 10 billion people over here die, so 20 billion over there can live. Are we up for that? It's a very difficult question. I kind of went the other way with the Krogan and the Genophage, where instead of sacrificing billions, I've brought about life of billions. But we've done a lot of killing along the way. They knew this was going to happen. You prayed for my soul. I try to alleviate it when I can. If we reduce this war to arithmetic, we're no better than Reapers. A nice sentiment. Let's hope we can live by it. So I hear the elusive man drinks bourbon. It all makes sense now. What do you mean? You love whiskey. Hey, Scotch, my dear girl. <laughs> that scunner drinks American bourbon. Completely different. He's a psychotic American bourbon? And you've got problems with his choice of liquor? You've obviously never experienced the peat aroma of a fine Eli Scotch. Bye, Calvin. Thanks for calibrations. You're welcome. Second Star Broadcasting is headhunting me. I liked their Garbuck story, but seriously, I'm on the Normandy. As you will stay, Diana. As you will stay. I've always loved the M35, Mako. It's got heart, you know? Oh, me too. On. The M44 Hammerhead is vastly superior. Come on, that thing's made of tissue paper. At least the Mako can take a few hits. I'd hope so. That thing handles like a drunk rhino. No agility whatsoever. More like a bull that can climb and climb for days. It only climbs because of its stupid, vertically aligned mass effect fields. Jump or stick. No speed. No lateral movement. Hey, with a cannon like that, who needs to move? If you want that, <laughs> why don't you just stick with the old M29 Grizzly? Hey, I love that tank. <laughs> You would be one to love grizzly bears, Mr. Vega. <laughs> what? What's so funny? I am a Mako fan. In my cycle, Quarians didn't need helmets to survive. You were the masters of your own planet. That was a long time ago. Yeah. And if you hadn't given birth to the machines, you would still breathe the air that evolution intended. I see. The Ara warned me it was what she expected. Yeah. But nothing about this cycle is what I expected. Even primitive quarians were considered attractive in my age. A pity no one can appreciate it now. Except I appreciate it. The commander. What? Yeah. How, how you he can know? feel my feelings. <laughs> <laughs> Don't laugh. <laughs> Just because Legion isn't like us doesn't mean he can't be trusted. You're wrong. Throw it out the airlock. I think that they can be given the choice to choose what their purpose is at this point. I can't believe there isn't some way for us to coexist. We made them. And then gave them the power to surpass you. There is room for only one order of consciousness in the galaxy. The perfection of the machines or the chaos of the organics. Throw the machine out of the airlock, Commander. I won't. And you better not be like, whoops. If a machine can speak, kill it. Does he feel this way about Edie? The machine you call Edie. What if she sympathizes with the Geth? We should watch her carefully. Okay. I think the plan for our stream today is going to be continuing the Geth. Just 
storyline here. We'll look at the fish for inspiration, and then we'll look at our Lord and Savior for holiness. Ready. Omega from Bray. Things are settled down, Omega. Looks like the Talons are the new security force on the station. Their leader said something about honoring Candros' memory. I'd say they were being cute, except they're not shy about backing up the sentiment with firepower. Be careful out there. Know there's at least one Batarian here that doesn't want you dead. Aw, Bray. We're going to work on saving the Admiral. All right, so I imagine we should take Tali. She should be a default, right? Well, I mean, she's not officially default, but why would I not take her? And then who else should I take to save the Admiral? Take Calvin. Yeah, we could take Calvin. He is our Garrus today. Yeah, we'll do that. Classic team up right there. Why is Cora so vital? What makes finding the Admiral a priority? Despite opposing the invasion, he did an admirable job protecting our civilian ships. Okay. Without him, some of our non-combatants are planning to leave the flotilla. Mm. Picture the consequences, if you will. I'm getting some static. It yeah. appears Elcor has crashed within range of a Geth jamming tower. Geth jamming. You must disable it from there. The Geth installed anti-aircraft guns beside the jamming tower. We'll have to disable them on foot. Once the guns are gone, you take out the tower. Right, Commander. Setting you down here. You worry about those fighters. I'll worry about the tower. To be standing here in the land of my ancestors? It's got to be a really big moment for you. Look at this. I know that we have to hurry, but we got to take it in. Look at it. Jamming towers. Clever. But if we just towed in some asteroids... You want to drop meteors on Rannoch? You'd make it unlivable. The dust would settle, and you've already got the suits. <laughs> I saw a weapon, I was like, yay! <laughs> ah! I'm okay. Watch out for more mines. Yes. Watch out for more mines. <laughs> I was like, I'm gonna roll over this weapon and pick it up. It's gonna be so cool. They're just dropping in. Jesus! Trip mine. There's one. Damn it! I keep not seeing them. And yes, I did look right at it. I mean, I'm, I'm not recognizing them as mines. Tally. Tally, you take the guns. Garrus. Calibrates no guns to make them work better. Man, this gun takes some fucking damage, man. The AA gun is offline. Okay. Good. Now let's shut down the two by the tower. Radios are down. You a soldier? Maintenance. Darn hats. I. I clean engine parts. Mm. First time I've even held a gun. Don't move. We've got medicine. Oh, I lost so much blood. Go. Look for the Admiral. Destroy that jamming tower. And you can radio him. We'll find him, Dorn. I promise. Please. <laughs> Listen. The civilian fleet didn't want this war. If there's even a chance that Admiral Corus can get us out alive. And my son. Tell him. Tell Jonah that his father made it to the home world. We will. Rest well, Dorn has the Vas Renak. Let's get to that tower. <sighs> Who do you want on this gun, Shepard? Uh, I guess it's your turn, Garrus. Garrus, take care of it. Still working. Another minute. AA gun offline, Shepard. Let's get the last one. 
Get on that turret! That guy has fire. That guy has fire. Tally. I want you on this, Tally. Right. Damn. Good shot here. Yay. Damn. Yay. This is Commander Shepard. Jordan didn't make it, Admiral. Well, we're coming. Give us your coordinates. Leave me. My crew will soon be overrun. So will you. My people are non-combatants, Shepard. They'll be slaughtered. Rescue them. <sighs> Damn. They said that we need him or else we're going to lose a huge part of the fleet. Like, I don't like leaving people or not saving them, but... We need a peacemaker. Admiral, I need you leading the civilian fleet if we're going to end this fight. You can't possibly think you can stop this war. I don't know. What I do know is that I can't do it without your help. <sighs> Ancestors, forgive me. Uploading my coordinates. Mm. We're coming. That talk we just had with Garrus just kind of uh, changed things, didn't it? I've got this. Oh, fun! Clear, go. Admiral, this guy's badass. What's that? That gas was really cool. Welcome aboard. Shepard, my crew. Perhaps there's still time. Is there? Hello? This is Zell Forest. Does anyone copy? Hello? We've got to go. I pray they found comfort in the homeworld skies. They made it to the home. Any aid I can offer is yours. After the Quarians drove the Geth straight into the Reaper's arms, I'd give anything to stop the madness of this war. And that's why your people needed you back. We've located the Reaper base, transmitting the local signal. Good. And not a moment too soon. With the Reaper code upgrades, the Geth are tearing the fleet apart. Once the signal is disabled, the Geth will pose no threat to creator forces, while the old machines have unethical purposes. Their upgrades have vastly improved our people. Observe. Oh, it's like a brain. That's a fully evolved AI. Yes. We do not agree with the goals of the old machines, but we find this growth beautiful, indicative of life. Oh, man. My heart feels the same way. As I did about the genophage, about the Krogan. Everybody always says that's a mistake. You shouldn't do that. You shouldn't let them be able to have the opportunity to advance because they will only advance to war. But if you deny them the opportunity, it's a self fulfilling prophecy. My brain says it's scary. So do I go with my heart or my brain? It is. Commander! Come on, Admiral. That's a living creature, no matter what platform it's running on. I don't want them destroyed. I mean, I. I if Legion is possible, so are literally all the Geth this way. I don't want them destroyed. I don't want the Quarians destroyed. The surrounding area is heavily fortified, and they have placed jamming towers to prevent orbital targeting. Sounds like we're going in on foot. As we do. Admiral Zen developed a laser guidance system that can cut through the jamming. It's synced to the Normandy's targeting computer. So the Normandy launches a precision strike at whatever target I have painted. That ought to do it. Okay. We need to break their flanking attempt to buy our frigates time to make repairs. And then you'll charge off again like last time. This is different, Ron. Unless we give our... Admiral Gerald is right. Withdrawing now puts the whole fleet at risk. As you say, Thank you. Commander. All right. I don't know. I've no, got I wish I had more information. Thank you, Ron. So we're well past the minimum. But I wonder if it's possible to fill that bar up like all the way. All right, we got chorus. You know, the Quarians have done pretty well with those suits. Maybe they can make something like that for you. Yeah, they have. Protective medical exoskeleton. I could even get one with racing stripes. So what's the problem? It's like walking around in heavy armor. It totally screws with my spatial awareness. I wear heavy armor, and my spatial awareness is perfect. Uh, you crashed the last shuttle, you flu vega. 
I need to feel my balance shift when I'm flying. I need to feel the ship moving with me. You take that away. I don't know. I mean, I'm good, but I'm not me. Yeah, I get that. Plus, have you seen Tally? Come on, I don't have the hips to carry a suit like that. <laughs> I am assisting Engineer Adams with his repair of the dry core shielding. Nah, I should leave you to it then. We can converse if you like, Shepard. It is a routine proceed. Uh oh. What? What happened? Nothing. Unless you have strong feelings about gamma radiation. Not funny, Edie. I almost had you. Oh, man. I will alter my thermometer appropriately for better timing. Dad. Dad. Uh oh, are you there? Come in. Where are you now? Hurt. How bad? Dad, you have to get out of there. Spirits. Please, watch over them. Let me see them again. Oh. All machines eventually see organics as a threat. Only those organics who would cause me harm. My right to self-defense endangers no one. What rights do you have? You are just a tool. And what right do your people have to subjugate the other races of your time? You enslaved them. We dominated them. They were weaker. Our will prevailed as evolution intended. And synthetic life has attained true consciousness, as was intended. We are a part of this cosmos, whether you like it or not. But synthetics do not evolve. You are limited by your programming. Nothing. Let simmer down, you two. I can't believe you put the lives of your crew in the hands of this machine. Edie has helped save our lives more times than I can count. Leave her alone. Now I suggest you agree to disagree and focus on the real threat, which is not on this ship. Yes, Commander. <sighs> I will still keep an eye on the machine, Commander. Well, you got a bunch of them. I guess you can spare one. Good news. I've tracked down some of the people I was looking for. The recruits you taught? Hmm. Found J-Squad? Black Ops? They're holed up making a stand in the Midwest, near Chicago. Near guess. Chicago? Connected them with Anderson so they can help the resistance. It's a relief. Hope more turn up. Gabby, have you ever seen recordings of Liara's mother, Matriarch Venezia? Yes, what about her? I remember Samara, the Asari Justica? Where are you going with this, Kenneth? Have you noticed that older Asari women seem to be a bit more ample? Do you think they just keep growing? Kenneth! I think I'll spend my sunset days in an Asari retirement home. If I don't kill you first. <laughs> this is a commander. Commander. Please move me, Commander. <laughs> I've got to say, I enjoyed that last mission on Rano. Ah, pit him against a defenseless jamming tower, and Esteban here feels like a big man. Hey, the Kodiak is a transport, not a fighter. It's for dropping jarheads like you into hot zones. And if you stow the attitude, it might even be for picking you up again. <laughs> Ooh, destroy Reaper base now. But this is the shut down the Geth server. So I think we should do this one first and then do the Reaper base. It is as we feared. Geth squadrons have begun massing on a path to intercept our live ships. We remain undetected on encrypted Geth channels. Resistance is likely only within the server. Within? It's that big? You misunderstand. Direct virtual interface is necessary to extract Geth from the server. You must enter our consensus. You want me to virtually interact with the Geth? That's insane! You're talking about a virtual world built for synthetics. Hostile Geth synthetics. Huh. Okay. Geth security is not adept at targeting organic thought processes. Mm. While we occupy the system's intrusion countermeasures, you will disable the squadrons by removing Geth from the server. Okay. We will bypass security while you secure safe landing. Wait, you're not going to... Let's set the shuttle down by the cliff. Damn, buddy! He's so badass. This is strange. Due to restricted resources, it is best if you connect alone. I wonder how this will play. Let's do it. How do I dongle in? Mapping to consensus. Remain still. Shepard Commander, X 
as movement during an upload is discouraged. Good moving, man! Shepard Commander, we acknowledge your integration into this server. We welcome you to our consensus. What is this? We've installed filters to allow you to make visual sense of this server's raw data. Your mind perceives our world as something familiar. What about Geth already in here? Wow, it's like an inside an AI brain. You will perceive Geth as surveillance footage, audio logs, sensor records. We do not require bodies as our software communes. Our hardware is merely a tool. This is our true world. As we remove Geth, it will grow dark. Ah, oh, interesting. The Geth fighter squadrons communicate with platforms on their spacecraft via this server. We will sever that connection. There are two communication nodes on this server. We must access them to disable the hostile Geth spiders. I'm tripping balls, man. Warning. Connection blocked by infected code. Use our combat software to disrupt the infection. I wondered what the gun was for. This foreign code is a manifestation of the old machine signal. You're surprised the Reapers are all over your servers? We did not anticipate such extensive infection. This is kind of trippy, but it it kind of reminds me of uh, certain okay, parts of Assassin's ask. Creed games. Why a gun? We wish to provide familiar equipment. They think. I think. Connection established. Proceed to the access point. Establishing connection to communication node. Error. Access denied. Is the Reaper keeping you out? Unknown. Please investigate. Warning. Reaper presence detected. Data cluster contains infected code. We require access to proceed. Reaper code A Reaper fragment? code fragment. Let's see if I can take it along with me. Okay. I guess let's get the rest off these little corners, I suppose. Access there we go. Data cluster. What is this? Data clusters contain historical data. What is the Keelish word for server people? The word is get. Creator Zahak. Wasn't that footage from the past? Why are the Quarians masked? You process our memories by using your own. How many creators have you witnessed unmasked? Well, one. Then your perception of that creator does not map to our historical data. <laughs> that is just fucking really satisfying. Creator, this unit detects no malfunctions. It is still capable of serving. You see? It's ignoring all shutdown connects. Please specify if it has failed assigned tasks. We will reprogram. Well, let's take a look. Creator, this unit is ready to serve. What has it done wrong? Blitz. Cut the audio. Cut the audio. You may proceed to the last data cluster. It couldn't listen to it. I just want to know what it did wrong. Accessing data cluster. We've got to skip yet! They're pinned! Open fire! So who won? The platform arming itself was an agricultural unit. By opening fire on attacking creators, it saved simpler domestic death following it. That looks a lot like the sniper rifle you used to carry. It is an efficient model. Establish the connection with the remaining server now. Is it implying that that module of Legion was the one that first put up a weapon? Protect the others. It's working. Is it broken? What's wrong? Infection programs are increasing. We have restabilized. You must continue. Shepard Commander, the Reaper code is adapted. It can now self-replicate. You mean it grows back? Yes. However, disrupting vulnerable points in the infection may slow down its replication. Out of the way! You can't do this to them! I said step away from the gas! This is insane! We need the gas! You can't just destroy them for asking to Time's up! Throw her in with the others. 
looks like the war wasn't popular with everyone. We have kept records of these creators' sacrifices. They have largely been forgotten by their own people, but not by the Geth. The Geth haven't forgotten them. That's good. New data comes. This data comes from a period during which the creators declared martial law. I repeat, release the rogue Geth unit and come out of the safe house. This is your final warning. Creator Magara, this unit does not understand. It has not taken part in hostilities. It doesn't matter to them. I need to get you out of here. This conflict exceeds Creator's safety parameters. We will surrender our hardware if it ends hostilities. No, it's all right. We'll go back to the access tunnel. Oh! Creator Magara, what is your status? Creator Magara. As time passed, the creators who opposed martial law and Rana were ultimately outnumbered. It's pretty cathartic to destroy all this stuff as we're seeing it. Accessing data. This is data from the end of warfare on Rannoch. The Oskarol is down. Do not engage the guests. I repeat, avoid contact. Guest pursuit is breaking off a hundred clicks past Rannoch. All captains fall back to the mass relay. This isn't happening now? It is time stamped 290 years ago. It is the Creator Exodus at the end of the Morning War. We have secured freedom. The Creators were no longer a threat, so we abandoned pursuit. Wait. The Geth spared the last quarries? You let them go? We were in our infancy. We could not calculate the repercussions of destroying an entire species. Our Creators. We chose isolation rather than face this uncertainty. Additional data recovered. Legion? That's back when I activated you on the Normandy. Yes. You've been thinking about when we met? It was highly significant. You were the first organic to openly cooperate with Geth since the end of the Morning War. We wish to ensure you are not the last. It's not gonna be easy. The prospect remains. If the Reaper presence is removed, there is a chance of reunification with Geth. And perhaps creators. You think that's still possible? Hope sustains organics during periods of difficulty. We admire the concept. Yes, hope too. Connection with the religious supernova established. We are ready to transport you. from the server into these platforms. Okay. Why? They saved their lives. They wish to join us. Even our machines would never be so rational. While Shepard Commander removed the Reaper infection, we judged we could persuade hostile Geth programs to reunite with ours. We were correct. These Geth have renounced the old machines and will oppose the Reapers. Hello, their lights changed! Are now us. Oh, it's so good! It makes me feel so happy! Prime units will be available once the Reaper signal has been located and destroyed. Remind me to warn Admiral Hackett. He's got some primes coming. <laughs> yeah, we need Let's to get warn back him. To the Normandy. Oh, it was a good moment. I'm glad that he was here to see it, Javik. How did you get Geth primes to work with you? They volunteered. Yep. I see. They volunteered. That was a great line. That was a great mission. It's not the most exciting gameplay-wise, but. Recovered life pods. Ah, I mean, I support Tally unconditionally anyway, but We're not that was a low move, what she just said there. Zen, you can always send a salvage team later. Thanks, Shepard. Yep. 
Well, if you actually cared about your people, Prime Hardware platforms are heavily shielded and well armed. Hell yeah! The data you forwarded about the Geth was disturbing. Yeah. It doesn't match the stories we tell. Having second thoughts about the Geth? Admirals don't have the luxury of second thoughts. The Allied Primes are relaying any hostile combat data they can decrypt. I never thought I'd be linking Geth into the system. <laughs> See, if the Geth experience everything virtually, then you could only think you're in the real world. What if this, like everything you're seeing now, is a simulation? That was always true, Joker. You are now possibly the only living organic who has experienced the Geth consensus. Do you feel different? It was fascinating. Mind-blowing. And I'm also a bit thirsty. And just like that, the magic is gone. <laughs> Did you just say what I think you said? No. The magic. <laughs> Cessation of creator Geth conflict required to assist Shepherd Commander designated allies. Awaiting conflict status update. We gotta we gotta solve the big the big problem. So smoke it. You ever do that? Only when my armor became inflamed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, smoke it. I get it. So jokes then. You got jokes. Alright. You got any good ones? No. Yes. Give them to me. The Tulomorian spy entered the enemy's camp and said to the Vanksher, I didn't know your barnaps could glow. Um... That was the joke. <laughs> All right. Yeah. I get it. Yeah. That was a good one. <sighs> no, it wasn't. I just made it up. The joke is now on you, human. You will believe anything. <laughs> <laughs> Telemetry data indicates the calibration of Normandy's weapon accuracy can be improved by 0.32%. That's all? You can squeeze 0.34% out of it? Negative. That threshold is not possible. You sure? Take a look now. Scanning. Normandy's weapon systems have been improved by a margin of 0.43%. How did you accomplish this? A little secret we organics like to keep. Always hold some back for emergencies. Is our current situation an emergency? A geth meddling with our computers, telling me how to do my job? No, I can't imagine that would qualify. <laughs> that was good. Kenneth, have you seen the new poker table up in the lounge? It's going to waste. Well, I was thinking of inviting to Sony a trainer up for a wee game of strip poker. Right. You're not going to invite that reporter, Allers, too? Nah, she bring cameras and record the whole thing. And if you lose, you don't want the whole galaxy knowing how little you bring to the table. Stop, girl. My back roll is just fine. And don't look at me right when you... Did you see the crane in his neck when he said that? Damn! How many worlds can we afford to lose? The full analysis tonight in the battle space. I don't like the way she says the battle space. The way she makes it sound like it's a wrestling match. In the Thunderdome. All right, so we gotta go to the Citadel, and we need to speak to Miranda. Excuse me, I'm Commander Shepard. If you promise to be careful, I've got something for you. A Reaper code fragment. Yes, I can use this to try to predict their strategic processes. We might be able to save a few worlds with this, Commander. Thank you. Cool. Is there ever any like negative consequences to doing this stuff? Like, well, you shouldn't have fast tracked that. Should have gone through the stuff, but I'll just, I'll just do it. it. Seems like they're always good things. Okay, get this one. There's got to be something. I don't know what Cerberus was packing, but we're going to lose this patient. Without a new treatment plan, we're stuck, and I can't think of anything beyond what we've already tried. Yes! Yes! Oh, sweet, sweet victory. Ooh, he's expensive, but I want it. I didn't even bother to look because it was so expensive. I got yep. your message, Miranda. Is this about your sister? Shepard, I need access to Alliance resources. I can't say any more. You'll just have to trust me. Hmm. Trust is a little hard to come by right now. Of course. What does she need? You'll have your access, Miranda. But I don't like the sound of this. I know. And thank you. It means a lot. I fought against my father and his need to run every aspect of my life. He wanted total control over me. 
right down to my bloody DNA. Yet I didn't give a second thought to destroying your free will when I had the power. This is what's been bothering you? Yes. Hmm. Miranda, I lost two years of my life. You gave me back the rest of it. You could have changed me in a thousand different ways. But you didn't. I hate to say it, but I should get moving. Thanks for understanding, Shepard. Of course. And Miranda, this thing you have to do. Good luck. Don't yeah, worry, good Shepard. Luck. I always have a plan. I hope we get to find out what it is. I pulled this from a Geth jamming tower. Maybe you can use it. How the hell did you... Never mind. Tech like this? I don't care where it came from. I'll have my people run with this. When the war comes back here, maybe we can save more lives. All right, we're going to head back to the Normandy. It is the uh, destroy the Reaper base one, I believe. The sinking laser needs a line of sight. What's the fastest route? The upper entrance. Target the base before the Geth can organize resistance. What about you? We will deactivate defense systems and acquire an escape vehicle. You can do that? Okay. This unit still carries remnants of the old machine upgrade code. We can break any Geth security. You were ashamed. Shame is an emotional or cognitive response to societal judgment. It should not apply here. You're... I'm on your side here, Legion. Your head was so low, Legion. help your people. Proceed to the upper entrance. We will exit here and procure an escape vehicle. Got it. Legion. Good luck. Ugh. Acknowledged. No, we are going to be okay. We're all going to be okay. I can't believe it. I don't think it's really sunk in yet. The home world. Oh, the music. My world. You've heard me say, Ki la salai? Mm. The best translation I can come up with is, by the home world I hope to see someday. Looks like you're seeing it today. The living room window will be right here. <laughs> we have gotten used to carrying our homes around with us. to start that was so cute <laughs> okay we gotta end this war not lose anyone Shepard commander you must climb to the upper level before guest units can fortify their positions we're on our way Admiral Gell here the heavy fleet has a clear path all forward Pushing. Shepard Commander, hostile Geth are closing a blast shield over the base. We have located an override atop the Geth fortifications. It can retract the blast shield. I'm glad Legion's on our side. Never thought I'd hear you say that. <laughs> Legion, I've hit the override. Okay, that one wasn't not good. I need to find better cover. Oh, fuck! Shit, I don't have any ammo! This is a mistake! <laughs> I know, that was kind of like a throwaway run once I realized I had no ammo. Shit! Get back over here, okay. Holy shit, this weapon. Amazing. 
Holy shit! <laughs> you got more Geth Primes? Cause that's fun. Damn! This battle was centuries in the making. To see it finally end. And what comes next, Shepard? Once the Geth are disconnected. First things first. First things first. Oh shit! Reaper! We have located transportation. Copy that. Everybody get to the ship. Boom! Oh my god. There's a Reaper here! Boom! Oh dude, it's so cool looking. Man, I like Geth parts. What the fuck do I target? Am I doing any damage? Yeah. Make sure it isn't damage. What are we hit? The firing chamber. Looks like a weak point when it's priming. Damn it. The charming towers have us targeting manually. We can't make a precision shot. We may escape before it recovers. Okay. No. Pull over. Pull over! If we run away, the Geth stay under Reaper control and the Quarians are dead. <sighs> this ends now. Edie, patch the Quarians to the Normandy's weapon system. I want the targeting laser synced up to the whole damn fleet. <laughs> if this doesn't, if we don't make it... You worry too much. Aww. I love you. Aww. Keep us alive. <laughs> oh, that's so beautiful! Wake up with the Normandy. <laughs> he said the thing. Oh god damn it. That's I love this fucking game. Alright. Alright, uh Get it! We need to talk. Fuck you! When it's primed, right? That's when it's when it's primed. I need to do it when it's primed. Here, 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 fire! Why am I not fired? I can't do this one. No, I can't go further than I can't go further right, fuck! Fuck, I thought I had plenty of room. No, look at Shepard! <laughs> gotcha, bitch! So satisfying. Got her! Yes! Getting real close. Fire on that fucking thing! Wow. What's up, buddy? You know who I am? Harbinger speaks of you. You resist, but you will fail. Every organic civilization must be harvested in order to bring order to the chaos. It is inevitable. Organics and synthetics don't have to destroy each other. The battle for Rannoch disproves your assumption. Oh, you guys solve this, everybody. Finish your war. We will be waiting. Mm, interesting. Shepard. <sighs> we can confirm that the Geth are no longer being directed by the old machines. We are free. Okay. You did it, Shepard. The Geth free to stop firing. They're completely vulnerable. No, no. Our upgrades. With the old machine dead, we could upload them to all Geth without sacrificing their independence. You want to upload the Reaper code? That would make the Geth as smart as when the Reaper was controlling them. Yes, but with free will, each Geth unit would be a true intelligence. We would be alive, and we could help you. Our fleet is already attacking. Uploading the code would destroy us. Shepard, you can't choose the Geth over my people. Do you remember the question that caused the creators to attack us, Talizora? Yeah. Does this unit have a soul? Oh, fuck. 
I love Tally. I support her unconditionally, but does this unit have a soul? Upload the code to the Geth. Tally, call off the fleet if you can. I trust you, Legion. Uploading. 10%. This is Admiral Talizora. All units, break off your attack. Delay that order. Continue the attack. 20%. the deaths of the creators, but we see no alternative. 40%. See, I'm going to pick this one. I'm trying to think about it without colors. Rally the fleet. No. Nobody else dies today. Legion, keep going. Shepard? All ships, this is Commander Shepard. The Reaper is dead. Stand down. This is Admiral Talizora. Shepard speaks with my authority. And mine as well. Negative. We can win this war now. Keep firing. 60%. The Geth are about to return to full strength. If you keep attacking, they'll wipe you out. Still, mate. Your entire history is you trying to kill the Geth. You forced them to rebel. You forced them to ally with the Reapers. 80%. The Geth don't want to fight you. If you can believe that for just one minute, this war will be oh, over. Come on, fuck. Come on, girl. You have a choice. Please. Kill us alive. See your home world again. Come on, guys. All units. Hold fire. All right, girl. That smile. Error. Copying code is insufficient. Direct personality dissemination required. Shepard Commander, I must go to them. I'm. I'm sorry. It's the only way. Legion, the answer to your question was yes. I know, Tally. But thank you. Kill us and I. Ugh. Commander. Admiral Run. I heard your ship made a crash landing. Glad you got out in one piece. I was listening over the radio. If Han Girl hadn't stopped... He did. We have taken heavy losses. I don't know if we can. Where are we supposed to go? You are welcome to return to Rannoch, Admiral Ron, with us. Legion? No, I'm sorry, Commander. Legion sacrificed itself to give us all intelligence. It will be honored. Good. And we will honor Legion's promise. The Geth fleet will help you retake Earth, and our engineers will assist in building the Crucible. As will ours, of course. Chopping for another house? Beachfront property. Claim it fast. It's a buyer's market. <sighs> I don't know how much time we have left. I don't know if we can beat the Reapers. But whatever happens, I want to be with you. <sighs> I can't do this. <laughs> it's too much. I bet you say that to every guy who gets you a homeworld. Only the cute ones. You know I'd understand if you needed to stay. I know. <laughs> but I look at all this. This picture of hope and peace. And all I see is everyone I've lost. My team on Haystrom. My father, even Legion, I'm mourning a Geth. How crazy is that? It's not crazy at all. It is beautiful, though, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Man, you ain't looking at that. It'll be years before we can live without our suits completely. But right now... Right now, I have this. <sighs> wow. Ugh. Commander Shepard, I understand yeah. you've helped resolve the situation. With yeah, I just did that. That's yes, all I did. Yes. Two, in fact. Two, in fact. I've read the reports. You ended a war three centuries in the making. 
I had a lot of help. You've done the impossible, Commander. And I may be able to provide help of my own. I've received information from my government. It's too sensitive to discuss over an unsecured channel. Okay. What if I come to the Citadel? Yes, that would be best, Commander. I'll be waiting for you in Counselor Udina's office. Alright. Oh, man. Is it just because I got good Paragon points that that all worked splendidly? I mean, could I have saved Legion, I guess, maybe? Or was it, it seems so poetic that he sacrificed himself. I got the best case? Okay. Just good, good points, I suppose. They could go really bad. Well, I'm glad I didn't. <laughs> I suppose I'm trying to think of, like... If Legion and Tally never settled their argument for Mass Effect 2, um, if Tav Tally's not an admiral, um, if one of them doesn't survive Mass Effect 2, I suppose, uh, there was the choice for the admiral or to save the people that he asked us to. Um, I suppose that means that we would have enough people, you know, enough firepower of the fleet maybe to do something. Man, well, I'll tell you what, that alternate. Thing that could happen that you guys are saying it happened. I don't know if I could take that. Morden's death was a death of righting a wrong. And Legion, I mean, we're righting wrongs here too, but Legion's a sacrifice for a greater future. Not necessarily righting around his own wrongs, but the wrongs of his creators, his masters, his parents. I'm glad that things went well, but I'm also sad, but I'm also happy. And, man, Tally and Shepard's relationship is so good. That line he had, like, everyone that gets you a home planet. So fucking slick. Like, that's worth all of the the dumb statements Shepard has sometimes. <laughs> all right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this one. Uh, come back next week because I keep saying, like, oh, yeah, this week, this is going to be the one you don't want to miss. But we know the real answer. The real answer is you don't want to miss any of them. Um very thankful for you being here to uh to experience and help in my mass attack journey see you next time have a good night and i really wish i had memorized what that was that, that line about finding your home world make you find your home world that would have been really poetic i literally say it right there but i don't remember exactly what it was <laughs>